in this video we will try to solve another question on profit maximization the question is like this a monopolist uses one input x which she produces so, sorry which she purchases at a fixed price of r is equal to for you to produce her output q her demand and production functions are p is equal to 85 minus 3q is her demand function and q is equal to 2 under root x is his production function we have to determine the value of price quantity and input at which the monopolist maximizes her profit okay now what is the profit function is simply given by total revenue minus total cost total revenue is simply price into quantity minus what is the total cost for this monopolist that is simply um, what we call the marginal cost times the uh, the input he is purchasing okay so p is 85 85 minus 3q to this we multiply this q minus marginal cost is for you into units of x produced sorry purchased so if we solve this this will become 85 minus 3 what is q is being given by this very function okay q is equal to 2 under root x so 3 in place of q i have 2 under root x okay to this we multiply this q again we have 2 under root x minus 5 x so this is the profit function so just rearrange this again so 2 5s are 10 2 8s are 16 that is 17 3 2s are 6 2s are 12 so we have minus 12 okay under root x into under root x is simply x okay minus 5 x is equal to 0 which implies 170 minus bath pounds is 17 x is equal to 0 which implies okay this is the profit function for this monopolist now first order condition for profit maximization requires that d pi upon dx should be equal to zero now taking derivative of this very function am i doing the calculation right or not here actually we have 170 uh, this is multiplied to this i got confused here so we have 170 under root x okay because this term is multiplied to each of these terms so we have 170 now derivative of under root x under root x can be written as 1 upon 2 its derivative is simply 1 upon 2 x to the power minus 1 upon 2 which become which it becomes 1 upon 2 under root x okay so i can write here 2 under root x okay minus 17 is equal to 0 or 170 upon 2 under root x is equal to 17 okay so this is here 85 so we have 85 upon under root x is equal to 17 or under root x into 17 is equal to 85 or under root x is equal to 85 upon 17 so under root x is equal to this will come out to be for you okay which means x is equal to if i transpose this root it will become square for you square that means x is equal to 25 that means the monopolist needs to purchase 25 units of input okay and what will be the profit maximizing level of output now let's check the second order condition also now second order condition requires the derivative of second derivative of profit function with respect to what we call the input and evaluate it at x is equal to 50 25 okay if it comes out to be less than zero we say profit is maximized okay so taking second derivative this was the first derivative where was the first derivative 
this was the first derivative if we take the derivative with respect to x again let us see what does this come out to be it will become 85 uh, minus 1 upon 2 x to the power minus 3 upon 2 and it will be obviously less than 0 okay so first order condition requires that uh, the slope of the profit function should be equal to 0 and the second order condition uh, requires that the slope should be decreasing at profit maximizing level of condition simple thing is like this we have if this is our profit function this is the first order condition and second order condition requires that the slope should be decreasing and this is being confirmed by this second order condition okay i am really sorry i cannot control the background noise here okay so you can easily see if you put x is equal to 25 you will see second order condition is also satisfied here okay so the profit maximizing level of input that he needs to purchase is 25 and what is the output that he will produce just plug this x is equal to 25 in this production function that is 2 under root 25 which will come out to be 10 and price will be simply just plug here 85 minus 3 the value of q is 10 so you will get price is 55 okay so we got p q and x that means profit maximizing level of price quantity and input that this monopolist requires okay i hope i make myself clear thank you